Are you serious? Are you serious? There has been a 100 car pileup on a South Korean bridge. South Korean officials say two people are dead. First reports were 42 injured. That has been up to 68 injured after a horrible pileup involving 100 cars in the foggy weather on a bridge near the airport there in South Korea. The, uh, the safety and management department, the fire and, and EMTs, said the number of injured could increase. Uh, the emergency workers are having trouble reaching all the damaged cars uh, on the highway. Uh, this is just horrible, folks. It happened when um, thick fog and icy roads on a bridge. So, you know, you know, you always have to be careful about ice on the bridge. Watch for ice on the bridge. It could be a morning, you're driving, everything's fine, and all of a sudden you come up on a bridge and it's a sheet of ice. It's black ice. It's completely like, like glass. And unfortunately... Fog will raise up, of course, a lot of times out of a river or out of a lake or a body of water. If the temperature is just right, where the temperature is one, uh, you know, the air is one temperature, the water is another, all of a sudden fog starts to rise. And if it rises right out of the river, right onto the bridge, and then the bridge is made not out of asphalt, but more out of concrete, that's why the bridge has a tendency to freeze over more than an asphalt road on solid ground. Now look, I'm not a uh, chemist here, but I'm just telling you, if it's foggy, slow down. But see, here's the thing. You don't know it's coming. You know, these people are rolling down the road. Uh, they don't know. They don't even, maybe there's, there's maybe not even fog. And all of a sudden you come up on the bridge. The bridge is foggy. You hit the fog. You hit your brakes because you can't see, so you slow down. But when you hit your brakes, you're on a sheet of ice. And then this is what happens. You know nobody planned on crashing. And we know on a good day, if there is a crash where there's two vehicles or at the most three, everybody else is able to slow down and stop before it gets any worse. But on a morning like this or on a day like this where the fog is extremely thick, uh, I saw one report on NBC It said, couldn't see past 10 feet you know, ahead of you, then what happens is they just keep crashing. And, and you can see, look by the look of the cars, people were coming at a pretty high rate of speed when they crashed on this bridge. So pray for these folks. Two people are dead. Pray for their families. And 68 now, 68 are injured. And that number may still go up. It is a disaster in South Korea. We need to pray. I want to ask you a question. This scene, this is a scene that could actually play out around the world in every major city at once. You do not want to be here when the wrath of God is poured out. There will be nowhere to go. Give your life to Jesus Christ. We're running out of time. Don't miss today's live broadcast at my website at 12 noon Eastern, as always, Monday through Friday, from 12 noon to 3 p.m. Eastern at my website, www.paulbegleyprophecy.com. That's W. I can't believe it. My camera just fell over. Are you serious? Like, like I said, you never know what might.